26 nothing to shout about. Little advice from the master right here. And Jordan with a fake. Yeah. Michael Jordan went around Robert Ory as if he were invisible. To have missed 11 in a row before that slam by Elden Campbell. Great move by Jordan, and he scores. That was a classic Michael Jordan move. 19-9, Chicago. Jordan, great move inside, and Michael Jordan teaching Eddie Jones a few things out there. Muscles it up there, but he leaves it short. Kobe Bryant shooting and hitting with Michael Jordan in his face. Anytime that you take care of the defensive board and you hold people down and shoot him to the hole. Oh, oh, no. There it is. Couldn't hold him down. That's Kobe Bryant. Good pass from Longley. Has to fire it up and hit for three. He's been good. He's a third stringer. Plays maybe better than a lot of backups in the NBA center. Kobe Bryant hitting a three from outside. It's when you get to playoff time in the matchups they do. Kobe Bryant is guarded by Michael Jordan, and the fall away by Kobe Bryant. That's the future, and even Michael Jordan will tell you that Kobe Bryant, the future of the NBA, you're looking at the present and the future right there. It is 69 to 49, a 20-point Bulls lead. Michael was all over him that time, right in the state. And Jordan with a move to the basket. We've got a little show going on here between number 23 and number 8. You kind of feel it, Josh. Yeah, you do. And the crowd does as well. And their quickness and to be good three-point shooter. And Eddie Jones got into foul trouble. Kobe Bryant, under a half a minute remaining in the third quarter. Michael Jordan with the short jumper. But this is how they play defense most nights. Michael Jordan gets two more. 34 for Jordan. Turn it over to the Lakers. And here's Bryant. Wow! Let's get the slam dunk back into the All-Star game after that one, huh? I tell you, that was impressive. That was impressive. <laughs> Did you impart any wisdom to him to, throughout the game? Oh, yeah, he asked me one question when we were down, uh, you know, bent down at half court, and he wanted to know how, when I turn around on my jump shot, how to lock the defense or how to get the feel the defense. I told him you should feel the defense with your legs. Once you feel the defense with your leg, you more or less got to feel where the defense is, and you can take advantage of that. So you're, you're, you don't have a problem giving away trade secrets during the game? Not at all. You know, it's just a matter of, you know, I think that, that enhances his, his basketball skill, and, you know, uh, someone did that for me, and certainly I... I'm not against giving him any kind of, you know, hints about his game if he asks. I'm certainly not going to, you know, come out and, and try to, you know, give him too much information. The kid, he's learned a lot in, in a short amount of time he's been in the league, and believe me, he's going to continue to learn.